Grand Rapids Public Schools is one of the worst budget situations ever. Today, district leaders will try to rally the community for support. GRPS is hosting a virtual town hall. Our Angela Cunningham is live this morning with what's at stake. Good morning, Angela. Good morning, Meredith. Well, quite a lot is at stake. District leaders tell us that because of COVID-19, GRPS has lost more than twice as much revenue as it did 10 years ago during the recession, and this district is not alone. Now, according to the district, the state's school aid fund is more than $1 billion short of projections for the current school year, and it's projected to be $1 billion short for the next. That will likely mean steep cuts. Now, the goal is to keep those cuts as far away from the classroom as possible. But 80% of the district's budget pays for staff, and the district says options are limited. Now, today, during GRPS's virtual town hall, district leaders will share the latest information with parents, teachers, and community members. We spoke with district spokesperson John Helmholt last week, who had this to say about this dire situation. Do you have school districts, including GRPS, that are going to propose a budget that has significant cuts. We're talking jobs, we're talking potential school closures, uh, we're, we're talking about elimination of non-essential programs and services. Now check out your screen right now. That virtual town hall is happening between 6.30 and 8 p.m. tonight. School leaders will outline the budget and share ways that you can help advocate for financial help. You can check out the meeting, the virtual town hall, on a live stream on GRPS's website as well as its YouTube page. Now the Board of Education has until June 30th to approve the budget a day before that on the 29th. One week from today, they will hold a public hearing and school board members will vote immediately after. Back to you.